Zen's making friends already. Oh, what do we do now? I'm e excited. Well, first, we set up camp. Zen, you could help Jack set up our tents while I go look for firewood. Oh. Both are leaking water. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> Zen, haven't you seen us sweat before? Oh! It happens when we work hard, like we just did now. Or when we're playing, like when I chase Jax. But wh why does it happen? Oh, I'm sure the Encyclopedia of Everything has an explanation. Oh, yes! Let me look for it. <sighs> well, well! You do sweat when your body works hard, be it setting up tents or b b playing. But that's the body's way of cooling itself. The skin helps the body cool down by sweating. Are you feeling thirsty right now? Yeah. How did you know? That's your body telling you to replace the water that has been lost through sweating. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, what next? What next? What next? Oh, let's break some of this firewood into smaller twigs. Ow! Oh, ouch! What happened, Jane? I scraped the skin on my ankle against the wood. Oh, it stings. Let me look up first aid information in the encyclopedia. It should be okay. From what I just read, the human skin acts as a barrier against the outside world. Human skin can heal itself. An antibacterial cream should do the trick. Did you know one of the primary functions of the skin is to protect the internal organs? Is that why we find our skin all over our body? A exactly! The skin keeps all the internal organs to save from external factors, such as the environment, harsh weather, and infections. The skin is the largest organ of the human body. Hey, what do you know? My scrape isn't stinging anymore. G great What next, then? Next, it's time for some fun and relaxation, then. Ah! Huh? Huh? What are you looking for, Jax? Some stones. We love skipping stones on the lake's surface. <laughs> I need smooth and flat stones. This stone here has holes and sharp edges on its surface. And when I touch it, it feels rough. See, this stone has no holes or rough edges. It feels even. The skin helps us feel things. It's, it's stone, stone skipping, skipping time. time! Oh, yay! Oh! Oh! Uh, oh! oh. Oh. <laughs> Kids, why are you twitching? Ah! What is that? This is a normal skin thing too, Zen. It's called goosebumps. We get them when we feel cold. Ah, goosebumps. Fascinating, fascinating. 
So, when you feel cold, the human skin shrinks, making the area around the hair on your body stand out in little bumps. The skin shrinks when you get goosebumps or when you're feeling cold or scared. Humans don't have much hair on their bodies. I guess that's why you all make a fire. This is beautiful. My first campfire. Stop! That tickles, that tickles, that tickles. <laughs> Zen, why do we feel ticklish? You only feel it in certain parts of the body. <laughs> Some parts of the human body are vulnerable to feeling this, like the soles of your feet, your waist, or your armpits. It's a way to make the human body defend itself. Whoa. Whoa. The skin is marvelous. Yeah. It helps us keep our body cool by sweating. It helps keep the internal organs safe from the environment and other external factors. It shrinks and you get, get goosebumps when you're feeling cold or scared. The skin is the largest organ of the human body. And it helps us feel things like warmth and coolness and how objects feel to the touch like smooth and rough. This is the best camping trip ever. I've learned so much about you humans. Oh, thanks to you, we've learned something more about our bodies, too. Yep, Zen. Best camping trip ever. <laughs> <laughs>